Hi. Now, oh, this is my 10th broadcast. Ooh. Okay, I'm coming on here right now. Um, kind of at my destination right now. Um, but I decided to come on here just to give a fair warning. This isn't for my friends or for my family. Um, if my friends and family are watching, this kind of this does kind of concern you, I guess. Um, but this is for my haters out there. Yes, my Facebook is public. Okay, anybody can watch this. Hey, Christina, how you doing? And it's not Christina, my my ex wife. So people know Christina. First, I uh, used to go to you know that. I was talking to you last night. She's out in BC. Um, but I just wanted to come on here and warn my haters. Okay. Um, I've had my ups and downs. I've had people, you know, making fake accounts of my pictures and stuff. By all means, I really don't care anymore. Um, you can say all the bad things to me. I really don't care. I'm a nice guy. I know I'm a nice guy. My friends and family know I'm a nice guy. But the warning to my haters. Okay. You may want to be me or you want something I have. I have no idea. But you might want to stop. You might want to stop the bashing, the hatred, the anger towards me. Because it's not me you have to worry about. It's my friends and my family that you have to worry about. Okay? You don't realize how far my reach is and my pull is. I have people, you want to bash me, you need to realize who you're bashing me to. Because they will tell me. Because my friends are straightforward with me. Okay, and if you want to bash me, you can stop. Okay, because the hatred is pointless. If you want to be me, talk to me. I'll tell you how you, you can do whatever I'm doing. You know, you can have the willpower, the strength, whatever. Uh, Kyle looking Felix and go, hey, how you doing? Um, but yeah, I wanted to come on here and warn all my haters. Um, you can bash me all you want, and you could try to sit there and go, you're not bashing me, I don't have time to bash you. You do, and I don't care. I have no reason to bash anybody. Um, well, okay, I, I can bash a few people, but uh, I need good reason to. <laughs> uh, hello. Um, I got five viewers right now, but... Uh, like I said, um, I have all, anything I say and tell you, um, I have my evidence. I have my proof to, to back up what I say. I have things from messages sent to me, to conversations between me and certain people. And like I said, I have nothing to hide. Chris Mack is watching. Now, so everybody knows, Chris Mack, who's now watching is my 30-year-old little brother in BC. Happy birthday, little brother. Okay? And hi, because you are watching me live. So I don't know what time it is. I forget the time difference offhand right now, but my little brother, Chris Mack, is watching. Hi, buddy. But uh, like I said earlier, um, your family's not by just blood. Your family is by loyalty. And most of my friends are my family. Now, I have over 1,300 people on my Facebook. My Facebook is totally public. Um, you don't have to be on my friends list to watch my videos, to look at my posts. You can say it the way you want to. Okay? But I'm just warning. Because it's not me you're going to end up dealing with. You're going to end up dealing with everybody else that respects me. And I have a lot of people who respect me because I've shown them respect. And that's who I am. You know, I will treat you the way I want to be treated. And I'll treat you with respect because I want to be treated with respect. But to all my haters, thank you. You put a smile on my face. Because, you know, you only, got a, you only have haters in life if you've done something really horribly, terribly wrong. Which I don't think I have. Or they just want to be you or they want something you have. And right now I've given everything that I had to some of my haters, just to try to get them off my back. But I don't care anymore, because you can't beat me. Nobody can, really. Like I said before, I, until the day comes, I am mortal, and I will never be stopped until the day it comes down to prove that I'm not immortal. Until then, I'm immortal. And like I said, people can get mad at me for my religious outlook on things. I was raised Catholic. 
Catholic upbringing. I baptized my firstborn Catholic and everything. Um, jealous. I don't know why you're jealous. Uh, yeah, yeah, haters are jealous. It's exactly right. Haters are jealous. Um, and my religious views is I believe I'm a god of some sort. Because um, according to my religion upbringing, um, God created man in his image. If you look at pictures of my kids, yeah, I definitely created in my image. And, you know, only God has the choice between life and death. And, well, a lot of people are still alive because I've chosen not to kill anybody. Because why kill anybody? You know, that's how we learn in life. All the ups and downs and everything in between. But I am at my destination right now, and I'm going to go hang out with some friends. And hopefully I'll come on later and say hi to everybody. Uh, but this one was mainly to tell my haters that you might want to watch out. Because... If you don't know where I am, you don't know where my friends are. And I have a lot of friends out there and a lot of family. So, until later, peace and love, all y'all. And so, you know, this isn't two in the pink, one in the stink, okay? This, this is two in the pink, one in the stink, okay? This, I've been doing since I ran for mayor in 2003, which stands for vote for the first. You know, because I was Michael J. Klotz the first. So until next time, peace, love y'all.